Hey guys, it's Joe here, and today again I want to talk to you guys a little bit about Sombra, and today I want to talk, you know, on a different note, um, kind of about what Blizzard has done wrong about Sombra, at least in my own opinion, and how they've kind of ruined the hype just a little bit. Now, of course, I'm still very hyped for the character. I can't wait for it to come out, and I want to buy Golden Gun for Sombra day one, but I feel like there are some big fallings about what they've done so far with, you know, her release, or not, well, I guess not releasing her in the first place, and, you know, some other things. And, um, of course, I do have a few Reddit posts in the description below that I'd kind of like to talk about, and one of the Reddit posts that was even about this topic got to about first place in Reddit, so I feel like that's also a thing that it does kind of give this a bit of credibility. Um, but basically, what I wanted to talk about is how I feel like with Sombra, they've been holding off this character for way too long. Um, of course, what was really cool about her is that way back before even Anna was out in the game, um, there were these cool ARG leaks. You saw all these things about Sombra, all these cool little leaks, you didn't really know what was going on, and Sombra was really exciting, Sombra was really hype, everyone wanted to know who Sombra was. Everyone was really excited for the character. And then, of course, you know, a little bit of while ago, we got a few more leaks, and it felt like, you know, she was finally coming. We've spent so long waiting for this character, uh, so long to just see what would happen with this character, and I feel like even if she does release, you know, today, tomorrow, it will be pretty hype, but we waited way too long for this one character, and I feel like the hype has really died down a lot for Sombra, mainly just this past week after the Halloween update really went off. Um, personally, myself, I don't want to hear all these things about, you know, Sombra's at 99%, now Sombra's at 100%, but you still can't play her. Um, we even saw, you know, uh, from ARG, that type of stuff again, that, you know, Sombra was completely done hacking, where she uh, kind of finished, you know, the load on Bash, and I'll show you a little picture right here. Um, so, you know, that's kind of cool, but at the same time, I feel like mainly with Sombra, she's just been held off for way too long. She's kind of just, you know, been that character that we've kind of been trolled with a little bit. We were expecting her all the way back when Anna was in the game. What would have been really cool is that, you know, we have these cool little leaks, um, maybe for like half a month or so we see the countdown going down, and then she finally comes out. But instead, we've had to wait like four or five months for a character. What? Uh, maybe not even that long, but we have had to wait quite a long time for this character, and I feel like really they've just been holding her off a little bit too long. And yeah, that, that's my big problem about Sombra. I feel like we're getting trolled just a little bit by this. And of course, I feel like a lot of other people also do agree. I kind of wish that the excitement could have had her released at, you know, peak excitement. Um, Even the Halloween update, I feel like if she would have came out right then, that would have been so awesome. No one, well, I guess we would have expected it, but that was just the time that everyone was really hyped, really excited to get Sombra. And then just nothing really happened. No news, no nothing. And I feel like that's what we've been kind of getting really awkwardly. We've been getting a little bit of news, a little bit of leaks and then nothing for a long time, then a little bit more, then nothing, and that's really not something that really cultivates hype way too much, at least in my own opinion. Now, of course, you know, I feel like they just wait a bit too long. I am still excited for Sombra, and one thing that I did find that I thought was a really cool idea is that what if they release Sombra, you know, today, tomorrow, maybe next Tuesday, something like that, and then at BlizzCon, they released a character that would be, you know, the counter of the new threat, the counter of Sombra, and that's why it took them so long to release this character, because they wanted to release two characters at BlizzCon in order to make, you know, BlizzCon seem really awesome and make a lot of people really excited for BlizzCon and make a lot of people excited for Overwatch at BlizzCon. I feel like that is a really good idea, and I'll, of course, link that idea to this guy that thought of it in Reddit, but I feel like that's a really cool idea, and that's something that would really kind of, you know, spice up the game. Um, really, the hype for Sombra has gone down a little bit. A little bit of people are disappointed, but I feel like they could kind of counteract that negative hype with the hype of a brand new character countering Sombra, countering the hacker, and that would be kind of cool. Now, of course, at the same time, they could just not do that at all, and they could do a very probable thing of just releasing her, you know, either this week, next week, or, of course, the week of BlizzCon, where there's really not way too much of it. I mean, if they release her at BlizzCon, of course, it'd be kind of cool. They could do a little thing where they're like, oh, no, Sombra's hacking our, um, uh, our presentation. That could be kind of cool, pretty interesting, but I feel like we're kind of just had way too long to guess what's going to happen. We kind of had way too long to see um, what's going to be going on, and we had way too much time in order for the character to be leaked, to be honest. I was kind of disappointed in the first place, you know, that she got leaked. I was really excited for her to just come out of nowhere, and I feel like they probably should have just announced her even, um, you know, after the leaks went out. But yeah, that's what I've been thinking. What do you guys think could make Sombra a little bit more hype? Give her some of that hype that she really had all those months ago. I feel like it's kind of been, you know, a roller coaster of hype. We've had a lot of hype. And then it would just completely bomb to zero. And then we'd have more, we'd have less, we'd have more, we'd have less. And it would just keep going on. And I feel like it was really cool to hear about her for a long time. But even with today, um, when we were just so ready for her to finally come out, we saw that 100% go all the way up. All we did was just get another teaser. And I'm, I'm kind of sick of getting somber teasers, honestly. I'm, I'm ready for the next character. I'm ready to, you know, either just wait for the next character to start development. Uh, wait for them, you know, to get some teasers. Anything like that. 
I've just kind of, you know, been a little bit done with having to wait for Sombra. I want her in the game. I'm really excited for the character. And I want to know what you guys are thinking about this character. Um, do you think that it's been way too long that they've kind of not cultivated the hype correctly? Personally, I think so. But I do want to know your own guys' opinions in the comment section below. As always, if you want to hear any more news like this and your more opinions, make sure to subscribe to this channel, leave a like, and as always, though, have a nice day.